This is a very fine 1845 wall map, uh, Chapin's ornamental map of the United States, and it has plans of Philadelphia, and this is New York, Baltimore, and Boston. And uh, it has a surround of the presidents, uh, it's nice Corinthian columns, and uh, a nice allegorical uh, picture beneath the title of the learned women of the world and the little, I love the little girl with the globe. Um, the interesting thing about this, though, uh, almost all of this is recognizable. Uh, Wisconsin Territory is, is slightly different. But here is the western states. Oregon goes uh, up into uh, Canada. Uh, Missouri Territory is long, uh, as is Iowa. Uh, Mexico comes well up to uh, what's the, now the Oregon bound, southern boundary. But the really interesting thing is Texas. This is uh, one of the earlier maps of Texas, because Texas is a brand new country at that time. Uh, it wouldn't have been there a few months ago before that. Uh, and it has uh, the Comanche Indians. Uh, the Red River is, is the upper uh, line. Uh, the, the state of Chihuahua, Mexico, and then the Rio del Norte, which is still a boundary. Uh, but it's uh, the strawberry-shaped uh, Texas, which lasted a very short period of time before they expanded to the West. Uh, and so that's one of the few depictions of that on a map at the time. 